for those of you who are marching and demonstrating in cities across the world and have been this last weekend and on your pro-Palestinian marches may I remind you Israel is surrounded by nations most of whom have an objective of wiping the state of Israel off the face of the earth. You complain about ethnic cleansing and the plight of the Palestinians. And I'm not in favour of war. I'm not in favour of any innocent life being lost, including life in the womb. But when you demonstrate in your anger, your resentment, your rage against Israel, Know that you are authorizing with your voice, with your actions, complete and total genocide. If there was a time machine, you should be back in Germany after 1933. But no, you shouldn't be because you'd have made matters much worse. Israel has a right to its homeland and to its existence, its biblical land for thousands of years. I am the God of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob, the great I am says. God will not be mocked. And you might know that Yeshua HaMashiach, the Messiah of Israel, who has overcome death, and this world will return to the Mount of Olives and every eye shall see him and every tongue confess that Yeshua, yes, Jesus, is Lord of all. Judgment is coming. Are you ready? The creed says that Jesus will return in glory to judge both the living and the dead. I will face judgment. You will face judgment. Think about your actions. Think about what actually are endorsing and encouraging, permitting with your rage. The total genocide of a people who have been persecuted for thousands of years. And I ask you in all humility and love to think of your own ways, turn from your sin, accept that Israel has a right to exist, accept that Jews around the world have the right to a peaceable life, and stand against every form of anti-Semitism. This is October the 7th here in England. This is my message. If I could, I'd jump on a plane right now, fly to Jerusalem and be in Jerusalem, Tel Aviv. But especially, I'll be praying at the Wailing Wall with my Jewish brothers and sisters and embracing them in the mercy of the Almighty Father, creator of the universe, the God who weeps for his people. I know that Palestinians have been suffering greatly. Tell Hamas to stop their satanic warfare against God's people. So what I'm going to say about it on this anniversary of the horrendous attacks on Saturday the 7th of October 2023.